Sagittarius, hi. Welcome to your sexual energy bonus reading. If you have not checked out your sexual magic deep dive, make sure you do that. Guys, if you did, thank you so much for watching. You guys got, I think, the top amount of views for that video. So I really appreciate you. Um, so I'm going to give you guys a sexual energy bonus reading. So let's dive in. Don't forget to hit that like button. If you're new here, subscribe. Ooh, first out the star. Could be dealing with an Aquarius here. Let's keep it moving with this sexual energy. Between Sagittarius and the person most heavily on their minds. We've got the two of swords. Okay. All right. So we've got the three of wands here. We've got the star. We've got the ace of cups. And we got the two of swords, bottom of the deck, we've got the six of pentacles, okay? So, somebody wants to give to this situation. Somebody wants to please you. Somebody wants you to give you the world here. Really spoil you, make you feel nurtured, make you feel appreciated, um, especially in the bedroom. You may find that this person is pulling out all the stops, doing everything they can to please you, Okay. They could be showering you with attention, love, money, sex. Um, this person, whoever you're dealing with, uh, this connection is very much about giving, all right? Wanting to satisfy the other person, wanting to wanting to make you come, if I'm going to be straightforward here, Sagittarius. This person really wants to show you what they got, is what I'm feeling. I feel like they have a lot of emotion for you here with the Ace of Cups, a lot of feeling. Okay, with the Three of Wands. Um, with the Star, they're very attracted to your body, the way you look. Okay, you could have a lot of admirers, um, but this person, they're willing to... <laughs> I feel like that's probably the reason why they're so interested in giving you everything that you want is because... They know that other people are interested in you and they could probably snap you up like that. Um, so they want to make sure that, you know, they're they're giving out those other people a run for their money is what I'm seeing here. Um, the Three of Wands, a lot of passion. Aries energy. We've got Libra, Aquarius, Taurus. It could be any water, Cancer, Scorpio, or Pisces. Okay. Um, but the sexual attraction is very real. You turn this person on, a lot of arousal here, okay? Um, a lot of emotion, overflowing. I see this as a, a bit of an orgasm too, um, if we're talking sex. The three of wands, <laughs> they want to explore here, all right? Um, I feel like if you are the feminine energy, they definitely like you on top, Okay. Um, they want you to ride. <laughs> if you're the masculine, well, you know what it is. Roles reverse, okay? Um, with the Two of Swords, air energy, I feel like intellectually you guys are well matched, all right? Um, in the bedroom, there's probably a lot of dirty talk on both sides. I feel like you guys could be even a little bit nasty here, all right? Um, this person likes you in the limelight. With the Six of Pentacles, I always see this as a lingerie card. So if you're the feminine, this person really likes to see you in lingerie, okay? And especially with the star, you are the star of the show if you're the feminine. You're definitely the star of the show here. Um, and the masculine really likes to see you in the limelight. So... Whether that be a little striptease, whether that be in lingerie or what have you, this person, this person knows that you're the star of the show, okay? And they want to do what they can to please you. They want to watch you. They want to be infatuated with you in the moment here, okay? Um, this person is very, very aroused by you is what I'm seeing here with this star energy, okay? Um... I'm also hearing like somebody biting your lip, okay, because we have this girl here <laughs> who's biting her lip, okay, that could be a turn on for either you or this person having their lip bitten, all right, I feel like there's a huge emphasis on the mouth, all right, I'm seeing a lot of 
teeth here. I feel like biting is significant in the sexual connection. Um, or just, you know, <laughs> biting your nipples, okay? Male or female, biting your nipples. Um, biting your lip. Biting your neck, okay? Um, I feel like this is a very sensual energy, especially with that that six of earth here, okay? Very sensual energy. I feel like it's a slow burn because we do have the three of wands passion, but it's it's not so high up on the wand energy that it's like this racy, you know, energy. I feel like this is more laid back, more slow burn, incorporates a little bit of emotional, um, a, bit, a bit of an emotional connection here, okay? Um, it's really like a we aim to please kind of energy. You could be dealing with a Scorpio. Check out their sexual energy bonus as well. But let's dive in and see see if there's more sexual energy here. What else is going on with you, Sagittarius? And you and your person. The person most heavily on Sagittarius' is mind. What's the sexual energy here? Ooh. Mm -hmm. tasting like I said emphasis on that mouth look at this too you guys could be twin flame even but this is union okay um mutual attraction here you guys both like each other <laughs> uh equally okay you guys are both sexually attracted to each other equally there could be a sense of dominance here the masculine I'm picking up could be the dominant could even be the feminine take it how it resonates okay uh sorry guys you might hear my pup in the back um, she just, she's ready for her walk. Um, yes, the king of cups here. Okay. Um, <laughs> this person's emotionally mature. Okay. And I think that's what makes them so sexually attractive here. All right. It's almost like this energy of possession, especially with that dominance card. It's like you're mine and only mine <laughs> kind of energy, okay? At least in the bedroom, even if you're role-playing, okay? Um, you know, ignorance is bliss, right? <laughs> even if you know what it is. Um, but this person wants to feel like they own you in the bedroom, all right? I, a huge emphasis on tasting, tasting your body, tasting your mouth, okay? Virility. This person cannot get enough of you. You cannot get enough of this person. The sexual energy here is very strong. Um, I feel like there's a constant arousal between the two of you. It's like you guys can even look at each other and it's just, you're gone to the moon, okay? <laughs> and then we have the caressing energy here, okay? So heavy emphasis on massages, um, just having your hands on each other's bodies, being really intimate here. Um... Like I said, whoever the masculine energy is in this connection, they are a true masculine, okay? They they have that dominant energy, very manly, um, rugged energy, very much like have my way with you, but there's still like that sensuality, there's still that emotion, there's still that passion. I think it's a really nice balance because we've got the wands, we've got the cups, we've got um, the swords and we have the earth. So I, and it's one of each. So I, I really feel like this person is very well balanced in emotional, intellectual, passion, sensuality. Um, like I said, they're like a little bit of everything. I kind of like it. It's like a, a pizza with all your favorite toppings. You know what I'm saying? Um, I'm going to pull and just see if there's any more energy here. Spirit. For Sagittarius and the person most heavily on their mind, is there any more energy here, any more sexual energy between Sagittarius and this person? Ooh, we've got the, na the knave of air. They like to watch. They could be a little bit of a lawyer. They definitely like to watch. Um, they could be watching you. Watching you when even when you guys aren't together, they could be watching you on social media. I saw the magician and the knave look at this <laughs> knight of water, <sighs> bottom of the deck, the punishment. Yeah, this person could be really kinky. Neptune energy here. This is very dreamy. You guys could even like get high and fuck or have sex. Um, if you uh, like high off of what depends, maybe you guys just drink, but. You know, it doesn't have, it's not going to resonate for everyone, but 
Maybe you guys just drink. Maybe you guys smoke weed. You guys could be into other drugs, each their own. We don't discriminate here, but look at this. This person's got romantic energy towards you. They're very sweet, very, very sexy, okay? Um, they could be watching you here. Uh, social media. They could be watching you anywhere, really. But they've got their eye on you and they want to make an offer. They want to let you know that they're interested. If this is someone that you're not already intertwined with, if you are intertwined with this individual, they just they just see you as a as an excellent romantic partner. Okay? They see you as a great partner in bed. They can see a romantic future with you here, is what I'm seeing in the sexual energy. Um strong Pisces energy here. Okay? This is beautiful. I see a really great connection. I see sexual satisfaction between the two of you. Virility. It's like it's nonstop. It's like you guys you guys just cannot get your fill of each other is what I'm seeing here. But yes, Sagittarius, thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like, subscribe. If you're interested in a personal reading, all of my information is down below. Thank you so much. Love and light.